like I'm on your bed, me. won't let that song come from around. Emi to fulo ju fulo wa. Funi go go yara go go resha ni mo wa du pe fun. Oma o kuma mi la wa ko kuma mi lori mo wa la la fia. Emi o she ni yo baba. Moro a rojile, lori a ye mi o, ibi a no ba ye mi de o, a rojile ni moro, moro a rojulo, lati ba ti o sin koko to fi be mi de bi mo de. Iba ta ye so po ti to ti wo lorun so ni gbagba pe oku Awon ilekun ta ye so pa won ti ti wo lorun so pe o si Emi ro aro tun ro mo ro aro jile o Ibi ya nu ba ye mi de o Aro jile ni moro Gogo gba ti mo wu wo mo to mo wu bo le layo ki se gbogbo eniyan to wo moto lo ndele won pada o awon ta won jade ni le ta won ba le lalafia e je adun my name is risikada joke sanunsi i was born in lagos my mother was from lagos state she's dead now and my dad actually is from abeokuta but he grew up in lagos too i started my primary school in lagos i went to yaba college of technology Before I came to United States of America, and um, after I got here, I changed my career from business administration. At this point, I'm a psychiatric mental health nurse practitioner by the grace of God. Oh my God, I can't believe I'm 50 already. When I was younger, I was very nosy, and I get into people's business. And they used to call me Risi Abebelude, Risi Rough. It was a very funny name and recently somebody just said that again to it was my sister actually we were having some discussion and she's like I can't believe you can be this calm Life has been great I thank God you know my dad um, actually was a very prominent uh, person in Nigeria he was a um, Supreme Court justice before he retired and my mom was a, a trader But I was raised by my mom and um, she, she did all she could to raise me to where I am today, to the glory of God. And my husband has been a supportive husband and my children has been awesome children. I got married in December 1997 to my husband, Moraki Olumi Wasanusi. He's the father of my children, my husband and um, my Lord. I have known my husband for a while when we were both um, teenagers, but uh, we're not friends or anything because uh, my husband's sister was my sister's best friend. They went to high school together. But I know he, he was hiring me, but I wasn't paying much attention to him at that time until um, he, re he relocated to United States of America. That's why he now kind of like um, reach out to me and um, you know told me how he's been you know looking forward to being looking forward to me being his wife but um, at that time i was kind of um, a little bit uh, you know shy and i really didn't have any boyfriend even though i was in my 20s I was raised in a very strict environment that they didn't allow me to really associate with men but um, because they, everybody knows him it wasn't really a challenging uh, situation because they knew he wasn't going to just you know mess with me and just leave me so that's how the whole thing started and um, we gave back to us your first son in 1995 Ayodeji Sanusi Oh my god he is a really wonderful son from the beginning even up till now after five years we had miriam miriam from the day one she's been a joyous uh, child to us and um, she's even our only daughter anyway so she got all she wanted as a daughter and uh, plus more 
She knows she's the only daughter, so she take advantage of it anytime she can. She's a blessing from God, and um, I pray that uh, the Lord Almighty will continue to be with her. After five years, we had Ulumi. Why well, everybody thought we, you know, we planned to have child every five years, but it wasn't even, you know, something that we planned. But it happened that they are all five five years apart. You know, never planned it, but um, we, we liked it because before one finish uh, college, before we start paying for the other college, the other one, you know, will go to college. So we have, we don't have to pay for two children in college which is um, something that will have been a little bit uh, difficult, but we thank God that everything worked out for our good. One thing I, I like about my husband, Muraki Ulumiwa, is that he's a very punctual person. When we want to go somewhere at two o'clock, he will start telling me, Risi, I know it takes you four hours to get ready, so you better start getting ready now. And eventually, guess what? I'm still gonna make him late to that place, and he doesn't like it. There was one day he almost left me and I said, well, you know, you can leave me, you know, I'll find my way there. And, but he didn't want to do that. So he always just give me time to get ready because I take too long. To, I don't even know what I do too, but I take too much time dressing up, getting ready. Friends, friends, friends are something that I'm very conscious about because I, when I was younger, I lived with my sister. And I saw how our friends betrayed her. So I've been very conscious having a lot of friends or, you know, being among a lot of women because the women cause a lot of trouble. And um, the few that I have, you know, have been supportive. They've been there for me at the time of my need. And um, some have betrayed me in one way or the other, but um, if you betray me, you know, I forgive you because it is important that I forgive you as a Christian. So I forgive you and um, I wish you good luck. And those that have been there for me, that are still there for me, I thank God, you know, for your life, for being there for me in time of need. When I cry, you cry with me. And when I am doing something that is, you know, good for me you are there for me to support me in any way so i'm grateful for god having you in my life and god placing you there for me to be my support and my backbone well in life i believe you do unto others what you want them to do to you so before i do anything i always you know use it use myself as an example if somebody do this to me will he be okay with me before I do it to other people. And unfortunately, I noticed that a lot of people don't really practice that. They just do whatever they want to do without realizing the impact of what they are doing to you. Do unto others, you know, what you want them to do to you. And that's my motto. And um, God has been giving me the grace to be able to continue to be good to people because I want people to be good to me in return. When I'm happy, I like to sing. Elonimo song for Baugo Elo Ni Jesu Iba Elonimo song for Baugo for Ere Lorimi because I don't even know how God can be so merciful to me. He's been a wonderful God. He's been a wonderful Father. Without Him, I don't know where I will be today though. I, maybe I will even be six feet below, but I thank Him because He's been there for me. That is the reason I'm using this birthday, my 50th birthday, to thank Him. That is the purpose of this birthday. It's not for anything else. It's to give thanks to God for keeping me alive, for taking me to where I don't, I never even thought I could be. It is only by His grace, His grace and His grace and His grace alone. Boje ni yon lo duro ni ati masiwe gun O ni duro mi e she un Well, 
In the next five years, I hope to be a millionaire by God's grace. I have all this plan in my head and I just pray that God bring them all to fulfillment for me. Ome event is about putting glamour to people's events. We'll pay attention to details and um, your events will be glamorous and uh, unique. We will put every details, you know, in it and uh, being a person myself of um, good quality because I do like good quality and I put it in everything that I do. You can tell by this uh, occasion that we are doing, this is all planned by Ome Events. Today we are launching Ome Events and um, this will be a start of a new chapter in my life and the life of my family because I know that the Lord Almighty is going to bless this and it's going to be a name in every household in Jesus name. I want to use this opportunity to appreciate all the children, you know, every children here, even the people that are not, the children that are not here, I want to ask that the Lord Almighty will grant them the wisdom, the knowledge and the understanding to take them to where God has ordained them to go, that their life, their destiny will not be truncated in Jesus name. I encourage everybody to eat as much as you want, drink as much as you want. But when you get drunk, me, me, Lord, my people, I don't get hand to carry anybody. You. So it's up to you. To everyone here today, I appreciate you. I thank you, friends, family, people that don't even know me, but you're here to celebrate with me, to appreciate God in my life. I say thank you. The Lord Almighty will continue to be with you guys, with every one of us, every one of you. He will continue to direct you, prosper you. Whatever you lay your hands upon, the Lord Almighty will make it prosper in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord. Eki e so wi pe o se o O se o O se o O se o E se 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 E se